You can't allow a challenge to make you forget what the point of the whole scene is about. <laughs> no, a uh, uh, Jim. <laughs> See, it was believed that the bride's penetrating glance could make you remember the darn line. <laughs> loser, loser, Wilson's a loser. I never liked the fence. I mean, I think it was a shame to hide his face. He had a very delicate philtrum. And in the right light, it was very attractive. Well, I like to think that Wilson was a faceless representation of pure intellect and raw reason. Or maybe it was just a gimmick. We're supposed to be in the yard, right? Right. You can hear people. I don't hear anything. <laughs> what in the hell is that? What could it be? It sounds like a lot of people, too. A lot of people somewhere. Right. Now, there's a, there's a fence here. There's a, and then there's a little alley, and it used to be very quiet little townhouses over there. Over there. Oh. There's the and park, there's the McGurns here. And crowds and crowds of people. Now, wait a minute. Where are you supposed to end? I don't know. What I'd like to know is I wonder who they are. Richard Karn, great guy. Overcame all the odds. Think of one other funny guy that became famous in plaid. You know, after eight years, tool time was like a, a well-oiled machine. Many different parts working together in harmony. Hey. Well, that's our show for today. Al, why don't you tell everybody about the good show coming? <laughs> well, that's all, that's all she wrote for today. That's right. Oh. Golly, Al, have you heard about 600 Sides New Tower? Absolutely free! What'd you say? Free? <laughs> Al, have you heard about, um... <laughs> Absolutely free! <laughs> Did you say free? I said free! And that's not all. <laughs> Al, have you heard about 600 Sides New Tower? <laughs> It was a lot of fun. We were a great team, like Starsky and Hutch, or, or um, uh, Stephen Eady, the ghost of Mrs. Muir, and and uh, uh, the, the motorcycle guys, you know, with the tight pants and the tall boots. Um, those guys. You know my assistant, Al? <laughs> Al, it's a demonstration. No one can start a Tim. fire with these. Al. Tim. Yes. You're on fire. Well, indeed, I seem to be out. But look there. It seems to be out now. We can continue with the demonstration. We're going to shoot Al out of a giant glue gun. I'm looking for a big, juicy uh, porterhouse. Good choice. We can't let Heidi go when she's just up to the TV. Um, my role as a tool time girl gave me a unique opportunity to stretch as an actress to take one line seven little words and to hone them to make them my own does everybody know what time it is does everybody know what time it is does there <laughs> yeah, not many people get that opportunity I was very lucky Debbie one word introverted Thank you. Mm. <laughs> wow. I wish Tim could hear you say that. I don't think he needs to hear it. <laughs> I think with all the money you pull down, you could afford the rest of those pantaloons. <laughs> What do you think with the money you pulled down, you could afford the rest? <laughs> <laughs>
You know, you think with the money you make, you can afford the rest of us. <laughs> I, have, I, have, I have to say the word culotte just once. <laughs> Coming up, the emotional final bows. I couldn't imagine a better group of people. And the moment you've been waiting for, Wilson's face revealed. Don't go away, we'll be right back. Ooh, guys, guys, easy, 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 easy. Pretty soft hands for a grip. Working with Tim was, was like um, sitting at the kids' table at Thanksgiving every day. Well, I can do this because it's the end of the show. I am a thespian trapped in a man's body. I'm comfortable with that. It has been everything. Hysterical, uh, fun, a little challenging. It was fun and exhausting and, and inspiring. Uh, I've spent more than half of my life here, so it's going to be definitely a change. Well, it was a lot of fun, even though I can't remember one funny thing that happened. But I'm going to miss it. Debbie Dunning! What I'm going to miss most about home improvement is the laughing. The everyday guarantee of laughing. Richard Carr! The routine of it. It's like all of a sudden you're out of school and, you, and it's fall and you know, I should be doing something. What is it I'm supposed... Oh, yeah, working. Playing Wilson is Earl Hindman. The camaraderie, the relationship with me and Tim, and the whole cast. Terrence Smith. It's like having this one huge family that you go and you see every day. Zachary Ty Bryan. I'm going to miss uh, the cast because we, we really do get along like a family. Jill is Patricia Richardson. That was really fun. I laughed all the time. And playing Tim. Tim Allen. I'm going to miss the family and crew here at Home Improvement. Backstage with my best friend. like oh my god Donna. oh my god oh my god she was she was she couldn't hold a candle to richard like that <laughs> it's richard big guy i met <laughs> he did horoscopes for miles davis <laughs> what did he do for you very soft hand <laughs> You know, and I know my, how, how matter how hard you try to fight against it, you're always your mother's child. Hey, I got a fun idea. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, well, I'm my own wife, and I don't happen to think that. <laughs> when you fight, where do you go? <laughs> to Taylor. Get you anything? Get a cold beer? Cold is your way in the bathroom. Take me a minute.
time to do this. Jello been in there. Long time. Okay. I hope you had as much fun as I did. And that's my final bow. Oh. Sit, hippie boy. Sit.